Ladies and gentlemen, check this out. Isn't that so nice? My dear friends here in Trstenik, Trstenik, Serbia, made me this beautiful little egg, man. Isn't that neat? Give me some Sarma. You gotta love these people, man. So nice. Ciao, 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 ciao. Check this out. This is one of the monasteries here from Lazar, his wife. And you're not supposed to bring cameras in there, but look at that. Isn't that pretty? From the 14th century out here, here close to Trstrnik. Come out here. Everywhere you go, all these little hills right around us. Really beautiful area. Hey, kako se kaže na srpskom? Ljub... Ljubostinje is how you say it, but isn't that beautiful, man? Really pretty place. I can't believe how decorated that is for being that old. Hey, we just went inside this uh, monastery. Uh, Ljubostinje is what it's called right here in Trsternik. And inside it had been burnt by the Turks, but there's still some really old uh, pictures and everything still there on the wall. Unbelievable. It's only for women out here that are allowed to work in here. That's their uh, quarters that they live in, right in here. And my friends from Trstani, they said here in the 90s when they'd had no milk, when there was inflation, they came here and they, uh, they had connections and they were able to get milk here. Uh, but beautiful, such a cool place way out here surrounded by the hills so much history it's cool to see the orthodox faith how it's so old and it stays that way year after year and you can see up here this is where they like the monk lady the lady nuns or i forget what they call i feel bad but they have their own little honey they have chickens and vineyard back there and they sell some other things and they live just on donations and things and selling their products but really pretty peaceful place and I hate to video too much because they had things said you're not supposed to have cameras out here okay so this is the name of the monastery Ljubostinja right here and one lady we were coming in and she said you're not supposed to take pictures because they put that out there on the on the sign but we asked one of the monks or nuns or whatever you call them and she said you can but just not inside uh, but anyway, beautiful little cafe right across the river. Beautiful trees and everything out here. It smells good, fresh. Such a nice area. Such a nice part of Serbia. So I always thought was cool too is these old corn uh, or these old hay stacks. How they do that, you know? Brings you back ages and ages and ages. Anyway, my friends, that's it. That's my friends here who drove me right over there. Good people. Good Trstrnik people. Hey, ciao, ciao, ciao. Check this out. This is the bridge here. I forget the name of it. What's the name of this bridge? Uh, the old bridge. Oh, the, the, stari, yeah, stari, the old bridge. The but this was built like in 1899, I believe, is what it was originally. And then it was destroyed by uh, NATO. Or it was like in World War II, it was destroyed. Like half of it was destroyed then. And uh, check it. I don't like to speak English too much when people are walking by. But anyway, it was destroyed half of it, and then they got it all completed. And then, like, May 1st, I think it said, 1999, they destroyed it. There's another bridge right down there, but they didn't touch it, but they touched this one. It would have been its 100-year birthday. They destroyed this one. And it took one year. They got it rebuilt, like, in 2000. 100 days, they had it redone. Not even a year before they had it redone. So, unbelievable. This is what they did all over Serbia. Every It's really sad. It sounds like an ongoing, uh, like I'm repeating the story, but every city I go to, you show a bridge, it was destroyed by NATO, you know. Unbelievable what they did all over this country. But beautiful little uh, bridge over this river. What is the name of this river here, Zapodnore. Bogdan? Zapodna Morova. Morova. The West Morova. But beautiful, this whole part of this country. We were just at that, the, this Kafana thing we was at was over, over this way. Oh my God. We gotta go. But anyway, beautiful day out. Gorgeous. Dog eats something. Down here. The dog, this lady is mad because her dog's eating something. Anyway, beautiful part of this, this country of Serbia, my friends. Ah, three 
prsa. Uvek prsa. Pokaži. Super. <laughs> Listen to this, man. This is Tristerni. <laughs> Some uh, Nadoko by a bite, and they said no. <laughs> Such a cool atmosphere, man. Everybody's so cool. Right there. Great shall you the Christos vos Christe. Today is Easter, and I just woke up. Oh my God, look at my view, man, isn't this beautiful? This is Tarstanik. I say it different wrong every single time. It's missing a vowel, man, you know? That's why I mess it up. But in this view, beautiful, I'm on like the 13th floor. There's a bar straight up there on the 14th floor we went to last night. I had live music, oh my God, it was so much fun. Bunch of my friend Bogdan's uh, friends and family. Oh my God, it was cool. But Idin is gorgeous, man. We are down in like a little valley here in Trstenik. We have hills surrounding us on all sides. Real pretty. Today we're going to Vrnjačka Banja, which is like the most well-known spa uh, in southern, so actually in all of Serbia. It's one of the most popular tourist destinations here, so I'm excited to see that. And we're going to eat a bunch, and then I'm coming back tomorrow to Novi Sad, my friends. But it's this beautiful, man, beautiful, clear air out here. Peaceful little town, but a lot of little things to do here. Pretty. Dovichinia. <laughs>